Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel and if you're new, welcome to my channel. My name is Toby and in today's video I'm going to be showing you how to do this look right here and all the products I used, well not all of them, but like my eyeshadow, my mascara and my lips are all from the Tartist, Tartist Treats Pal Pack, I don't even know, <laughs> but it's by Tarte obviously and it's this little combo pack and it was only like 30 seven dollars i don't know but it was really really cheap um well for three items i find that pretty cheap and it comes with the tardis lash paint mascara which i already have and i love um the tardis pro to go eyeshadow palette which oh i love this little thing so it is this big so it's absolutely amazing for traveling and then these are the colors you get in them i really like them because they're all warm toned and they're just perfect for a lot of different reasons and then lastly you get the Tardis Glossy Lip Paint in Woman Crush Wednesday. I'm guessing it is because it's WCW. It's this teeny tiny little one here. I think it's so cute. So yeah, I'm going to be showing you a look I did using this little palette here. And I thought I would throw in the extras as well. Because if you're going to be buying this palette, you, I guess, would want to know how this... Wait, yeah. You know, by this palette, I guess you want to know what these are like. I really, really love the mascara, but I've never tried any of their lip... Are these lip paints? Yeah, I've never ever tried any of their lip paints before. Personally, I would go for more of a nude, but I like it, and I've never had such a dark, glossy color before. So, yeah, you'll have to see all that. I don't even know what I'm doing. I'm going to shut up now, and let's get into the video. So as usual, I'm going to start on my eyes. So I'm going to go in with my LA Girl Pro Conceal in the shade Porcelain. And I'm going to be putting this all over my eyelid. And then I'm going to be taking a really fine brush and using this to clean up my eyebrows. Which just make them a lot more sharp looking and just a lot cleaner. And then obviously I'm just going to be taking the remaining product and using this as a base for my eyeshadow. So this will just clean up any imperfections and just make a really nice even base for our shadows. So once I've finished blending all that in, I'm going to go ahead and set it down with some pressed powder. This is just from Australis, but I'm going to set it down so that when we put the shadows over the top, they're not tacky and they blend as best as they could. Then I'm going to be taking the shade called Drive, which is a kind of light brown, but it's very warm toned, which I love. And we're just going to be putting this in the crease as a transition shade. Then I'm going to go in with the shade Crisp, this is a really nice burnt orange and I'm just going to be buffing that into the crease. Next I'm going to be taking the shade Stylin and this is kind of a kind of grapeish color but we are kind of going for a purple eye but I'm going to be putting this right in the outer corner for some definition. Then of course I'm just going to blend that throughout the crease so there's no harsh lines. Then before I put the lid color down I'm going to go in with this NYX jumbo eye pencil in the shade cottage cheese. I just really like to put this down before I put any sparkly colors over the top just because I feel like it really enhances the pigment and I feel like it sticks to the lid a lot more instead of transferring. But speaking of the lid, I am going to be taking this beautiful like purpley, it's more berry in person but it's like purpley burgundy-ish and it's called Dominate. So I love this shade, it's so nice. I've never really done a look like this but then I'm going to be taking Hype and I'm going to be putting that in the inner corner for just a bit of pop of light I guess this is a really nice like champagne gold then of course I'm gonna go in with my essence dip brow eyeliner and do just a classic wing because that is just my favorite thing to do I feel like my looks are not complete without a winged eye
Then I'm just going to go ahead and prep my lashes for falsies and for that I'm taking the Tartist mascara which I love because it separates your lashes so well. Then I'm going to take Hype again, wait no is that Hype? No, Crisp. I'm going to take Crisp and pop this under my lower lash line just to even out the look of course. I chose the orange because I feel like this complements my eye colour the most. Then going back in with that same TARDIS mascara, I'm going to be putting this on the outer part of my lower lashes. I don't really like the look of mascara on my bottom lashes, so I just like to put it on the outer corner. Then I put on the lipstick that was in the pack, or it's actually a lip gloss in the shade WCW. I'm not too sure how I feel about it. I think it might be a bit too shimmery and dark for me, but I think it's a cute color. But yeah, that is it for this look. I hope you enjoyed it, and I will see you in my next video. Bye!